I walked in here and I started hurting. <laughs> Bruce Coldren and Ron Lee played for the Ducks back in the 70s. People say, what is my favorite highlight is when Knucklehead right here ended up scoring like 31 points. It, it was just a fantastic game for him. In February of 1974, the Ducks were coming off a loss to the USC Trojans the night before playing the number one ranked UCLA Bruins. The Bruins had just lost a game of their own to the Oregon State Beavers the night before, ending what had been a 55-game conference winning streak. Coach Harder was a little bit upset, and he kind of was, okay, this is our season. This game against UCLA is our season. And the fans agreed. But our locker room was a small locker room, you know, and then we're underneath the floor, so you can hear the people stomping. And I mean, as an athlete, just hearing that. Okay, it's like, okay, you're getting psyched up. And then all of a sudden you go upstairs and they open that door and all you're going, wow, you know, what a feeling. Coldren and Lee say the team was all about physicality. They wanted to make their opponents pay, earning them the name, the Kamikaze Kids. And the Bruins witnessed this firsthand. Lee says players would sacrifice their body to get possession of a loose ball in any situation. Okay, if we beat them, we, what do we have to lose? Okay, they more they got more pressure than we do because they have something to sustain with the number one. You know, if we beat them, okay, hey, yeah. This weekend would be coined the loss weekend, for the Bruins, that is, as Oregon defeated them by five points. Even today, the players from UCLA are still haunted by this weekend. I've talked to Bill Walton a few times since then, and he always remembers that game. And the, it was the worst. He said it was the worst, worst basketball time of his life. While the Bruins might painfully remember this lost weekend, it is one for the Oregon history books. One that Bruce Coldren and Ron Lee say they will always remember. Reporting for Duck TV Sports, I'm Mitchell Ribrell.